back. Um, the cockpit's not answering. Somebody's stabbed in business class. And um, I think there's mates that we can't breathe. I, I don't know. I think we're getting hijacked. Which flight are you on? Flight 12. And what seat are you in? Ma'am, are you there? Yes. Area. What's going on, Betty? Betty, talk to me. Betty, are you there? Betty? What's in DC, you lost her? Okay, so we'll, let, we'll stay open. We, I think we might have lost her. Yeah, how close to you? Come to us, come to us. Well, what is that? Something, somebody hit uh, the World Trade Center or the... Stay on that. On the last one. There's nobody up on 23? No, they evacuated everybody down. I think that, that there's some really crazy people in this world. Uh, this is just not uh, too many innocent people. People were jumping off the building. Body parts all over the place. I mean, this is just... I feel like I was in a movie. This just in, you were looking at a, obviously a very disturbing live shot there. That is the World Trade Center and we have unconfirmed reports this morning that a plane has crashed into one of the towers of the World Trade Center. screaming and then just an explosion. Glass, then everybody was uh, running around. Looks like six, seven floors were taken out, and there's more oh, explosions there's, oh, right now. Hold on, people are running. Wait, hold, so, hold on, just a moment. We got an explosion inside. The building's that... exploding right now. You got people running up the street. Okay. Hold on, I'll tell you what's going on. Okay, just uh, put, put Winston on pause there for just a moment. Okay, the whole building just exploded some more. The whole top part.
passenger on United Airlines Flight 93 that was en route from Newark, New Jersey to San Francisco. He called his mother just minutes before the plane crashed near Pittsburgh. Well, that I love you very, very much in case I don't see you again. I said that. That the plane has been taken over by hijackers. And, um, and then I said, well, we love you very much too, Mark. Let me go get your mother.